So today we're doing a fashion shoot with the beautiful and talented model and contemporary dancer Renee Stewart. This is the no makeup makeup look. It's how to look flawless without looking like you're wearing any makeup at all. So I know you're used to using a brush like this for your foundation, but when I was living in Paris and doing all the runway shows, this is all we were allowed to use for our foundation. So we would focus on leaving as much of the beautiful natural skin as possible and just removing any imperfections dot by dot. So the first step is to prep the skin for the perfect canvas. My favorite moisturizer at the moment is the Rose Hip Plus Night Cream. Even though it's a night cream, I use it for the daytime as well. It's really important to have well nourished skin because when you're not applying foundation everywhere, you really need a smooth surface for the concealers to blend into. Because we're not using any foundation at all, I'm just mixing my moisturizer with a touch of the concealer to create a bit of a tinted moisturizer. So now we're spot concealing and it's literally by going spot by spot, applying the tiniest little bit of product with a little brush and then patting it with your finger until you can't see where the product is and it blends in completely with the skin. It's like retouching a photo in Photoshop. You just take out any imperfections as you see them. When you're doing a technique like this, it's really important to choose the perfect concealer color because you need to match it perfectly to the natural skin tone. One of the other areas where you need to be a little bit more careful usually is around the nose. Remove any redness around there. And under the eyes. So the next step in this natural makeup, I'm using Coco Cabana by NARS, which is a cream highlighter. And I'm just pressing it into the cheekbones to give them a little extra lift. Down the top of the nose. And this really makes the skin look like skin, even if you do use a heavier foundation. And another little spot I like to use on if I'm not actually doing any eyeshadow, which we're not today close for me, is just across the mobile lid, which is from the lash line to the socket line. So to make the lip look like we're not wearing any lipstick at all, we're actually going to use the product and just press it into the lip and we're using, choosing a color that's very close to a natural lip color. Just open for me. And we're just gonna press that in gently to give it a little bit of color and make it look just like a natural lip. So that the eyes look nice and awake, we're gonna curl the lashes before applying the mascara. I'm applying the mascara directly onto the fan brush. I'm using a fan brush so the lashes look really natural and I'm not taking the product straight to the lashes with the mascara wand. So rather than filling in the brows or doing anything so defined, today we're just going to spray a little bit of hairspray onto a spoolie brush and push the brows up, up and outwards from the eye. And then you just draw along the top of them to tame down any strays or ones that are going a little bit too far, but we want them always to just go up and very natural. And something that we used to use a lot, um, but doesn't seem to be used that much anymore, are blotting papers. Rather than using powder, when powder you tend to build it and build it throughout the day and you keep on adding more, by the end of the day you end up having a lot more makeup on than you started off with in the beginning. So with these, you can just simply apply it to any areas that have too much shine and it absorbs the excess oil without disturbing the makeup. So it's another way of reducing how much makeup you actually wear throughout the day if you get too shiny. You're normally gonna focus these on the T-zone. So it actually takes a little bit of work to look like you're wearing no makeup at all, but I definitely think the effects are worth it. What do you think? Oh wow, it looks so natural and like I'm not literally wearing anything. That's exactly what we want. We want it to look flawless, but with no makeup on. It's amazing. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go.